on to SummerSlam. Two new matches are on the cards, kids. Of course, uh, we're on the Mark Hoke Show here on Kadon. Braun Breaker will get another shot at the Intercontinental Championship. He will square off with Sami Zayn on Saturday night out there at the Cleveland Browns Stadium. Isn't that interesting that uh, they're going to be doing another dog pound? Have a feeling that Sammy will not be evading the uh, the power of Braun Breaker this time. Looking forward, I think, to a new Intercontinental Champion, but should be a lot of fun. The interesting part on Sammy's side is is that he has just been lamenting that nobody gives him the respect that he's all tired of being considered the underdog. Why? Why? Well, look at Braun Breaker. Well, of course, look at Gunther. It would be, shall we say, a shocker if Braun does not win this match. I think it's it's time for the coronation. WWE could pull a curveball, though. Maybe somebody doesn't want Braun to win that Intercontinental title. I don't know who that person might be. But Ilya Dragunov sure can't be happy after the beating he took about a week ago. So we'll keep an eye on Sami Zayn and Braun Breaker. That one's added. But this one that is added in as well, it's time. It is time. And I hope my friend Bruce Bruffer does not sue me for copyright infringement on that. Punk and McIntyre with Rollins as the guest referee. Punk has been cleared, so Punk and McIntyre will face off at SummerSlam. The question is, when it comes to this match, is this the main event? These guys in the chat box. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this because I'm going to ask Doc Mueller this one. Is this the main event of SummerSlam? You have world championship matches, and I'm sure you're going to get a, a tag team title match now with what happened on SmackDown. But is this truly the match that should go on last at SummerSlam? I think so. I think so. That's one of the great things about WWE right now is that you have so much great talent and they're doing a terrific job booking in this company that it's hard to really decide what a main event is it normally should be a world championship. You got Cody defending against Solo Sokoa with a bloodline thing going on. Right? I mean, you could you could make an argument that the Rhea Ripley Liv Morgan match is a true main event. But given what these two have been doing to each other and that they have completely overshadowed Cody Rhodes right now, I, I hate to say it. They have. I think this is the main event of SummerSlam. I could be wrong. I'm not first time, but this match is going to be very intriguing. I'm sure it won't be the last, but these two guys just keep going and going. And of course, very interesting that (laughs) <laughs> Drew put up a picture of him and Jack Perry on Twitter and then pulled it down real quick. They coordinated that, but still pretty funny stuff. But as long as punk doesn't break, that one is going to be off the charts. The crowd is going to be going nuts. Drew might get booed out of the building. I don't know. We'll see how many punk maniacs are out there but that is going to be a wild one coming up at SummerSlam but yeah so if you think that's the main event or if you think it's not you know let me know I said we'll talk to Chris Doc Mueller from Bleacher Report in hour number two about that hey there adventure seeker ready to unlock incredible hotel deals get a free membership and save up to 50% stay grand Spend less. The simplest site, 
the best unpublished hotel deals. TheTravelShark.com